So we evaluated 50 subjects treated on our CD19 CAR T-cell trial at Seattle Children's Hospital called PLATO2. Uh, we evaluated the role of transplants in reducing leukemia-free survival in these subjects and found that um, subjects who had not had a history of transplant prior to CD19 CAR T-cells following attainment of remission, they did seem to benefit from pursuing a first transplant following CAR infusion. With regards to those who have a history of transplant, it's less clear on whether the subject should pursue a second transplant following CAR infusion. However, for subjects with short uh, CD19 CAR T cell persistence, um, we did see that there's an increased risk of relapse based on our phase one um, trial with the um, data have already been reported. So we looked at that patient population separately and for those with uh, shortened persistence of their CAR T cells, there does seem to be a benefit for transplant and abrogating that increased risk of relapse. With regards to implications for the patients uh, treated with CD19 CAR T cell, I think that we continue to see um, a number of late leukemia relapses and so as the um, research and landscape is improving CAR T cell persistence and reducing long-term relapse that um, we do see a benefit in pursuing allogeneic transplant after attainment of remission in uh, subjects without a history of transplant or those at increased risk shown with shortened CD19 CAR T cell persistence. And so I think that that is important while the, the field is working on CAR T cell persistence and reducing long-term relapse. I think the outlook for patients is excellent um, given that these are all very high risk patients, often very refractory to chemotherapies um, or relatively relapsed. And so the fact that over 90 percent in our phase one trial is shown to attain remission. I think that is excellent in this patient population, though our um, overall goal is to um, maintain that remission status for long term, particularly for our pediatric patients. That's important who have a long life to live.